Local lawmakers are also working to get shots into arms. Today, Orlando City Commissioner Regina Hill helped get seniors to the FEMA vaccine site in Orlando. News 6's Crystal Moyer was there as those at an increased risk of dying from the virus were able to get results. Over the past month, Orlando Commissioner Regina Hill has been working with other local organizations to canvas areas in northwest Orlando to help seniors that may not have access to transportation or the Internet get a shot, like those here at Lake Lorna Dune Apartments. 80-year-old Evelyn Bell says she's tried to make an appointment to get the vaccine herself with no luck. I kept trying to call and call and get the, get the shot and they put me on the, had to stay on the farm about all day and then I still didn't get it. Bell is among the nearly two dozen seniors here at Lorna Dune Apartments to get a free ride to get the vaccine. Pegasus Transportation offering their services for free. The west side of Orlando has a large population of not just African Americans, but the Hispanic population. A population still falling behind when it comes to getting the vaccine. According to the Florida Health Department, out of the more than 176,000 people who have been vaccinated in Orange County, only 8% are black, less than 1% are American Indian, and 20% are from other groups. Sky 6 flew over the Valencia West FEMA vaccination site as the bus pulled in, one of Hill's assistants capturing video of the visit on Facebook Live. You can see the excitement from some of the seniors, one dancing as she steps off the bus to get the potentially life-saving shot. FEMA staff were on hand to help wheel some of the residents inside to get the shot. They were able to choose which one, some getting the one-dose Johnson & Johnson, while others received their first dose of the Pfizer vaccine. About two hours later, the bus pulled back into the apartment complex. It was easy and quick. I didn't really feel it. I wish there were more people like this that would do something like this because a lot of people are, you know, home and they can't get out. Pegasus Transportation will return here in April to help transport those who need a second dose of the vaccine. Hill says she and her staff will be moving on to Magnolia Point Apartments tomorrow to canvas for any seniors that need help registering and getting their vaccine. In Orlando, Crystal Moyer, Getting Results, News 6.